All right, you can't see me very well. I have my, my headlamp on. <laughs> but um, yeah, I just wanted to show you what it's like out here. Enjoying a little campfire in the pond. And it's almost a full moon. Let me turn this around. It cooled off quite a bit this evening. So the campfire is quite inviting, actually. It's so quiet and peaceful out here. And look, it's actually pretty bright with the f almost a full moon tonight. The smoke's coming this way. Hey, Kink. I've been having fun with these solar spotlights you can find just about anywhere these days. They've really come a long way. Um, the camera's not really picking them up as good as they look in person. What you doing? Are you sleeping? Ollie, were you taking a nap? Were you napping? Were you napping? Did they wake you up? We'll take a quick little walk around the pond just to see what's going on since I have my uh, headlamp on and all. It actually lights things up pretty well. Unfortunately, it attracts a few little bugs that are still zooming around tonight. The waterfall sound is from a pump, a sump pump actually, that we have submerged in the water. And my husband kind of made a pipe. Well, not really. It's like a hose and it squirts the water straight up and back into the pond which has been working out really nice at keeping the water moving when we're not in there swimming the blue tint you see is actually from a product that you put in ponds called blue it's basically like food coloring and it makes the water darker more blue and the reason you do that is to stop algae growth or help prevent the algae growth there's Ollie's floaty floating around the pond tonight. Spider down there. Oop, he just ran under the rock. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's a spider web. See a kink? see it? We're going to help that little spider have a nice dinner tonight with our spotlight shining near that spider web. And the next moth will fly into it. Nice movement. Little fish. Little tiny fish. Boy, it's hard to focus on those. Those are my solar lights. I put it under the tree. It's right there. They have them on both the trees up here. Hard to focus on them. The video lens on my iPhone just does not pick up that solar spotlight on these two trees along my driveway that well. I'll have to uh, post a photo on here of what it looks like. It's actually quite attractive. Two solar lights. I got I got those at Walmart for I think they were twelve bucks for the pair. But it looks really cool from the house. The lights them up nice. See some eyes down there. That's kink. Look, there's something out there. I can see the eyes. Way out there, see it? I'm pretty sure those little eyes way out there in the meadow is oh. probably a cat because there's lots of little mice coming in as it starts getting cooler at night. Is there anything you saw, Ollie? <laughs> I got my flashlight on my head, don't I? He's like, what the heck, Mom? <laughs> Back at the campfire to make perhaps the best snack of all, a yummy homemade s'more over the campfire. It's getting poofy. It's 
trying. Oh yeah. I'm over here. It usually blows into my face. Pretty close. I only get to video it. Look at that. That's a perfect marshmallow more piece of all the chocolate in there. Did you hear that, Allie? What? It's not like a raccoon or something. Pretty sure that was a kitty out front. There's a lot of mice down there. Seeping. Are you seeping? Taking a nap? Thanks for checking out my video. I'll have this on my website where I have other creative videos and stuff like that at burnhouse.com. Hope to see you there. <laughs>